Hey, pretty girls, pretty time. Welcome to the pretty girls club. If you know, hit the subscribe button. If you're not, hey, girl, hey, as you can tell from the title of this video, y'all, I'm gonna be teaching y'all a little something, something today. So, basically, um, today I am on TikTok Live. TikTok, say hey, it's yourself. I'm on TikTok Live, and I just encourage some of my girls and some of my supporters to do a battle of the states. So, we're doing the battle of the states today, and basically, what the battle of the states is, is which state can get the most orders today. So far, we have Florida in the lead with four orders. Then we have South Carolina with three, we have Georgia with two, we have New York, New Jersey with two, Utah with one, Mississippi with one, and California with one. So I'm going to sit y'all up and let y'all watch a little bit and then we're going to come back and chit chat and kind of, I'm going to give you all some teachings and some methods that I'm using um, just to promote and to engage my girls and my supporters while we are on TikTok Live. So just sit back, relax, and enjoy the rest of this video and stay tuned to the end because the end I'm gonna give y'all the tea. Okay, so what's paparazzi? Y'all don't have a paparazzi. I'm I'm my own paparazzi. Thank you. So we got two more orders. Again, like I said, we're trying to have a battle of the states. We're at battle of the states. Oh, y'all, Florida, the first state to 10 orders today will win. Florida just got another order. Florida just got another order. Thank you so much, Florida, for coming through. Y'all are, see y'all. Georgia, where you at? Anybody, anybody from Georgia go shop? Georgia, I have my money on you. I have my money on you, Georgia, and y'all are letting me down because Florida is sweeping y'all at this point. Florida is sweeping us. Florida is officially sweeping us. So we have Louisiana. So Miami, Miami, she ordered the boho bracelet. A boho bracelet. Thank you so much. And she's from Louisiana. But this next person just came through. Evelyn always comes through. Evelyn comes through and she's from Florida. So that makes Florida officially has five orders for the day, girls. Florida is officially sweeping Georgia. I have my money. Thank you. I have my money on Georgia. But y'all are unfortunately letting me down. We are in Atlanta together. We are here in Georgia together, and y'all are disappointing me. So I'm about to I'm about to switch teams. I'm about to switch teams and go to Team Florida because Florida is officially winning. Florida has five orders for the day. Um, and Evelyn purchased the pretty kitty Pandora style bracelet, which is officially sold out. And she also ordered a brown, yes, get these gone, a brown wrap bracelet. A brown wrap bracelet. Yes, you done, yes, you have put Florida at the very, very top. And South Carolina was coming through. We did get two, remember we got two South Carolina orders back to back. So they were trying to come strong with three orders, but they done fell off. They done fell off. So Florida is officially in the lead. You all voted to see which um, state can get to 10 orders or as close to 10 orders as possible. So we're going to see which state can do that. And as we are seeing now, most likely it's going to be Florida. Florida is halfway there with no competition. Florida is already at five orders for the day. And yeah, so I want to show y'all this. Some more bracelet stacks really quickly. That is on the website. Everything I'm showing is still available for purchase on the website as of right now. Oh, this is a cute one. It's a beaded set, but it has the planner charms. And it comes with three different ones. This is a bangle stack that's super cute. And it has like a little Barbie. So yeah, all those are on the website. And we're officially at 15 orders. 
So thank you all for that as well. So let's check out the website. Let's see what's going on on the website. Again, like I said, if you're in Georgia, South Carolina, or Florida, and you want your team to win, place an order. The first team, the very first team slash state to 10 orders or closer will be the winner of the day. Um, and of course, everyone that's in these states will get some very, very cute jewelry. So again, like I said, so far we have Florida with five orders, South Carolina with three orders, and Georgia. Another one, thank you. And Georgia is in last place with two lonely orders. But I'm still thankful and grateful. Of course, I'm just being joke, joke. I'm just joking. Of course, I am definitely grateful and thankful for all y'all orders. Don't get me wrong. But we're just having like a little competition just to see which state can get the most orders for the day. Um, we just got another order in. So let's see what state that person is from. Hopefully they're from one of our another one thank you um hopefully we're going to see where we just got two orders so now we have patricia and we have let's see patricia is coming in from michigan chris patricia is coming in from michigan and it's our first order, so thank you so much for the support. Okay, YouTube, we are back. So I'm gonna give you all an update. We have an order from Whitney. Whitney is, guess what guys? She is from Florida. So Florida officially has six orders for the day. Six orders for the day. She is number six of the day. And we said the first state to hit 10 orders will win. And Whitney just came through and put her team at the top of the top with six orders. Okay, y'all, so let's recap what just what y'all just saw. So, as you can tell from the this video, it says I shipped to 10 states in one day. And that is exactly what I did. So today, um, we shipped to Georgia, South Carolina, Florida, New Jersey, New York, Utah, Mississippi, California, and Michigan. And so basically, what I did to encourage those sales from those different states was create a competition. I know you all heard a little bit of that during the live segment. So I was like, because people always ask me every day, like, what's the goal? What are we going to do today? And stuff like that. And I'm always trying to figure out different marketing tips, y'all. Like, y'all know me. I don't I don't just do, just have a sale and just get the orders. No, I try to be creative as possible with how I get my orders in for the day, how I market myself, and how I just stand out from the crowd. So I was like, so on the top of my head, I was like, let's have a competition. Let's see which state can order the most can can make the most orders today and so my girls they they ran with it so florida placed seven orders today georgia placed two south carolina placed three new york new jersey placed two utah placed one Mississippi placed one california placed one michigan placed two so that left me with almost 20 orders in 10 different states y'all so i just want to figure out a way to be different so all those different states they probably weren't even thinking about shopping with me but because i was having like a little small competition and because i was being hyperactive and my girls participate in a competition i was able to navigate those sales we finished the day with 21 sales but two of those sales were ebooks so that was what 19 sales today so 19 actual physical sales and we shipped to 10 different states y'all so one two three four five six seven eight so eight, I think it was eight states. I, I don't know if, I, if I'm gonna say 10 or eight. I think it was eight states that we shipped to today. But regardless of the fact, y'all kind of see what I did. So you have to be creative with your with how you market yourself. I could have just easily said, oh, I just want 20 orders. And then, you know, and whatever happens, happen. But I put a, like a little spunk on it. And I was like, let's see which states can order the most orders, can place the most orders. And Florida came through with the orders and stuff like that. So just y'all think of like different like ways to be different. Make it a competition, make it fun. Cause you don't want to just get on live or just do, you know, get on Instagram, get on live or just get on social media platforms and just be so salesy. Like you don't want to have to, you don't want to have to ask 
verbatim for orders. So think of a way to ask for orders without asking for orders. So that way today was, let's see which state can place the most orders. So I kind of threw it back on my customers and made them feel involved in the process, made them feel seen as well. And every person who placed the order, I shot them out, let um, let everybody know what state they're from. And people love hearing their name and stuff like that as well. So I kind of threw it back on them. So instead of me just sitting on live, asking for orders, asking to count down orders, I was like, let's see which state can come through with the most orders. And then I also have my favorites. So before the competition started, I was like, I think Georgia's gonna win and stuff like that. So I kind of, you know, made like a little bet and I kind of asked them in the chat, like which state y'all think is gonna win. Everyone either said Georgia or Florida, but obviously Florida won. So you gotta just think of cute and cute fun ways to get your audience involved. And you're gonna get a lot of new customers. Um, let's look to see. Uh, I'm looking at the analytics to, to let y'all know how many new customers we had, how many return customers we had. So we had 13 new customers. So we gained 13 new pretty girls today. And then we had eight return customers. So that that's still really good. So kind of almost nearly half and half. So we had 13 new girls um, that shopped today. And those are 13 girls that probably wouldn't have shopped if I didn't have the competition. And they probably wouldn't have heard about me if I wasn't on live. So this is why I always preach going live every day, going Instagram live, going TikTok live, just showing your face every day is gonna be helpful to the Instagram and um, TikTok algorithm and helpful to your business as well. Also too, when you do go live, don't be so serious, like don't beg for it. It's like, y'all know me. I do not like when people are feeling like I'm begging for orders. So um, that was just a cute way for me to ask for orders without asking for orders. I was trying to, I was saying, yes, throughout the whole lot, which state can get the most orders. So now we're at Florida. So I was counting down the states as well. So I was like saying, okay, Florida now is at four. South Carolina is at three. George is at two and stuff like that. So I was kind of keeping them updated as well and keeping them invested and interested in the competition. Um, and I kept the competition going from when I first started this video until the end of live. I think I was on live for, um, let's see how many how long i was on live i was on live for for 108 minutes so what's that almost an hour and a half i think 108 minutes an hour and a half a little over an hour and a half i was on live so nearly two hours 10 states two hours that's a pretty good day to me um the, i'm not gonna lie the order value was pretty low today as far as like what they were spending on um i didn't i had a lot of like five dollar items i think um i was trying to get rid of so i kind of got rid of the five dollar items i wanted to get rid of but a lot of people were just replacing like five dollar items five dollar orders ten dollar orders so the order value was pretty low today but that's okay i still was able to gain 13 new girls and out of those 13 girls today i'm pretty sure at least eight is going to come back and shop again at least so that's going to be another sale for me from another day you know so, um, so yeah, I want to just say get on live and just make some games, make some competition, make it fun and friendly and interactive because no one wants to sit there and watch you beg for orders or no one wants to just sit there and just watch you look at orders. Like you got to be fun and funky and interactive with your customers. That's how you're going to get the sales. So I want to just let y'all know, try out, try out a, like a little steak competition just to see and just to see how it do, how it goes and if you do try out this um tactic let me know in the comments how it worked for you if it did work if it didn't work let me know in the comments um if it works you can send me a dm on instagram if it worked just just try to try new things out and try to be creative with y'all like um that state competition just really came to me out of the blue like i don't even i wasn't even thinking about making a competition state because honestly i was gonna just gonna laugh and just relax today because i don't really have much to do but then it came to my head like do a competition just so you can get some orders and then record and you know record it as well so yeah y'all like i said i just love creating content i love my business so that's why i'm always putting a hundred and thousand percent hundred thousand percent into my business i'm always thinking of new and different ways different ways to be different different yes different ways to be different from the others um new ways to be different from the others and like i said every time i learn something i try something out and it's successful for me i'm always willing to share it with you just to like let you know also of course like uh, um like y'all already know i do have how to make sales ebooks on my website how to wear followers ebooks on my website content ideas on my website as well but if not, if you don't want to pay for anything, just make sure you subscribe to my channel. And I'm always willing to drop some free gems. This might be the last free gem I drop on this page about how to get sales and how to get followers, stuff like that. But um, 
just know that yeah this might be like the last one so if i try a new tactic out most likely it's going to go into an ebook instead of being a youtube video but if you all do like videos like this make sure you're watching it from beginning to end make sure you're sharing make sure you're liking and commenting because the more interactions i have on my platform the better my videos are spread throughout the YouTube community. And also, too, if you all engage in type of... If y'all engage with these videos more, then I know what kind of content to create for you all. So, um, I hope that video was helpful. I'm pretty sure it's like a quick little snippet video. Um, just watch me on TikTok. And then I'm just explaining what I was doing. Again, like I said, try a state-to-state -state competition. Try to choose like three states. Because I... I I chose South Carolina, Georgia, and Florida to be basically like the versus because those are the top three states that um, shop with me anyway. So just try to choose states that shop with you anyway and then say, okay, let's do a Florida versus, um, my, uh, I could say Miami, Florida versus Georgia or if Chicago versus New York, something like that. Try to just be fun and different and let me know in the comments how it worked out for you 